had to wake up early and take Charlie to Geneva to meet his dad. And on the way up there, I saw several dead cats on the highway. As I was leaving Beaver Dams, I saw, you know, cats just loose. Why do you all do this? You, you people are just lousy cat owners. The life expectancy of an outdoor cat is about three years. I don't want to hear about your cat that's six, okay? Your cat's lucky. It's ridiculous. It is. It's horrible. My, I have a cat that doesn't go outside. Cats do great indoors. There's no reason to inflict your cat upon other animals, too. You know, just, just remember the life expectancy is three years because there's predators. There's human beings that don't like cats. There's cars. There's disease. There's lots of reasons not to let your cat outside, okay? And here's a good one. In the United States alone, cats kill about 4 billion birds every year. 4 billion birds. You think that your cat needs to kill? What? You don't feed your cat? And if you're not feeding your cat and you're letting your cat eat wild game like that, your cat's going to get sick, could get leptospirosis, parasites. There's a bunch of reasons that you shouldn't allow your, your cat to do that. And one of the good ones is that it's killing unnecessarily. A cat will kill everything in a square block radius. Everything. Besides the 4 billion birds that cats kill every year, they kill about 21 billion small animals, meaning mice, lizards, whatever they can kill. You've done this. My, my cat lives indoors with birds. He doesn't kill anything because I've trained him. You don't want to train. You clearly don't want to train your cat. Oh, let's just let the cat go outside and be a cat. What's the matter with you? It's a domestic animal. Horrible, horrible owners do this. You, you don't care about other animals clearly and you don't really care about your cat. It's the truth. It's the truth. Leave, leave your cat indoors. And by the way, why I'm on the subject of cats, all cats should be on a raw diet. Don't be feeding your dog or dog or cat pet food. Pet food is filled with a bunch of carbs and stuff. Your cat doesn't need carbs. Either does your dog. Look at the bag of cat food or the, even the can of cat food that it has grain and stuff like that in it. Your, your, your cat doesn't need anything like that. Your cat is a carnivore. Put your, dog, put your dog and cat on a raw diet, find out how to do it, and don't think it's just about giving them a can of tuna, which is probably one of the worst things you could give a domestic cat. That doesn't even have calcium in it. So no, if you're going to put your dog or cat on raw diet, that it has to have a lot of calcium in it because animals that eat other whole animals are eating bone. So if you just give your cat or your dog hamburger, it has no bone in it. You're going to screw up your, your animals, your pet that you supposedly love. You're going to screw up their calcium phosphorus level. Don't do that. Do research and don't let your cat outside. You care about your cat? Don't let it outside. The life expectancy is about three years. They do fine inside. What's the matter with you people?